Severe storms battered Switzerland, dumping more than 100 millimeters of rain in some areas, and leading to extensive flooding and landslides, authorities recorded on Sunday, June 30. The torrential downpours, coupled with rapidly melting snow, caused a dramatic increase in water levels in several rivers, notably the Rhone. This surge in water led to severe flooding, debris flows, and numerous road closures, affecting large areas, and leaving entire streets and residential districts underwater. Many vehicles were swept away by the floodwaters, and the damage to infrastructure and properties was substantial. The Rhone River, in particular, overflowed in several places, triggering the evacuation of hundreds of people in the canton of Vallis. A statement from the local government on Sunday highlighted significant damage in the valleys near the Rhone River in Upper Vallis. The flooding was so severe that the Vallis canton had to call upon the army for assistance. The resort town of Zermatt was completely cut off from the rest of the country, due to the floodwaters and ensuing transportation chaos. The floods rendered roads impassable and disrupted railway services, leaving residents and tourists stranded. In the wake of the floods, local governments and communities are assessing the damage and beginning the long process of recovery. The focus now shifts to restoring infrastructure, providing aid to affected residents, and implementing measures to mitigate future risks. The impact of the storms extended beyond Switzerland, affecting various regions in northern Italy as well. Northern Italy experienced similar weather conditions, with floods, thunderstorms, and landslides causing widespread disruption, 